you better move that pole. Take it out, you're gonna break that rod. Oh, there they are, they're under the boat. Lock it in, lock it in. Go, 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 go. A shark right there, get it up, get it up, get it up. There we go. Ooh. Whale shark right here. Over here in the Bahamas, you never know what you're gonna see. There's nothing organized about it, it's just straight chaos. There's no teamwork around here. There you go, jumping right here. Frigate's coming in. Go, 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 go. This is Tuna City right here. They're within 100 feet of the boat. Oh my god, it's smoking. That's a big tuna. Whoa! Oh! This is a freaking circus. <laughs> over, under, under, over, over, under. Look out! Oh! This is what we're out here for. This is, this is what we do. Loose Cannons is brought to you by Angle Coolers, more than just a cooler company. Conley Fishing, the number one source for serious fishing equipment. Dolphin Electrial, the power choice for serious fishing. And by JFB Construction, America's builder. It's important that when you're in the Loose Cannons, sometimes you just gotta wear the extra gear, whether it's a helmet, with our shoulder guards. Me and Joey, like I said, we've, we've we spent a long time together and we like to hurt each other physically. Oh, sorry. <laughs> stay in the game, stay in the game, stay in the game. Watch it coach, I'm out. But when you take a tuna to the face, it hurts. I was knocked out cold on my feet for a good eight seconds before I realized what happened. Oh, sorry. All year long, I was dodging tunas. The whole season, he tried to get me. I dodged him. Look out! Oh. I zigged and zagged, blocked. No, it was... And he connected on the very last day. I thought I had it made. I've, uh, I was mistaken. It was sore. Still don't like to talk about it. I don't want to hear about your tip or your rod. Alright. Good talking to you. Thanks for coming out. Be here all week. Make sure to tip your waitress. Come on, Ed. Get him in. Hurry up. Oh, I got one now. Oh, yeah. There it is. I think we got in a school of a couple big ones. I know I got about a 50 pound fish here. Get her in there, get her in your plane. There you go. I'm just saying, my money's on the Mexican. <laughs> like any heavyweight fight. Like any heavyweight fight, my money's on the Mexican. We got uh, Captain Joey on the back, hemmed up on the 30 pounds. You can do it, Manny. We're close. We're close. Go Go back. You're touching the boat. You're touching the boat. Touching the boat. You're touching the boat. It's going to break. Lean over. Lean over. Lean over. Lean over. Gaff. I need a gaff. Oh, Joey's got a good one here. Woo! Yeah, look at this one. Oh! Ah! <laughs> nice, Joey. Woo! Nice, Cap. And the hook just came out. No, I took it out. <laughs> nice job. Dude, I'm so wore out. My back's about to go. Yeah, hand off. <laughs> All right, coming back up. Coming back up. We got a fresh angler in the house. All right, we're on our third angler. Come on, Howard. 
Gonna turn on him. He's right go. here, guys. He's not far out. Well, we got a big shark. We thought it was a tuna, but it's definitely a big shark. <laughs> Howard's gonna bring him up real close here to identify him. We saw the oceanic white tips, hammerheads, bull sharks, tiger sharks. And every time we go out, it seems like we're, we're on tuna and sharks. The waters of the Bahamas are, are shark infested. So, you know, you can dive in them and you can spear some fish, but, you know, do so with caution because they are shark infested. 3rd angler down to his knees on this damn shark. He's thinking outside of the box, <sighs> one to one. <laughs> what the hell are you girls doing up there? Oh, wow, a good, good shark here. He's a loser. Oh, he's a big guy. Uh, he's a reef shark, big reef shark. Look at that. <sighs> That'd be a good place to have some uh, pelagic gloves. Sharks, well, we could try to cut them real close to the mouth. Even though it's a big shark, mono, the hook was right in the corner of the mouth. We want to cut it as close as we can. We want to have some fun. We want to protect the resource. <laughs> Third angler was the charm. Would have been worth it if it would have been a big yellowfin. Now I'm shot over a shark. Man, a lot of drag on that reel. How come it doesn't break when you want it to? Loose Cannons is brought to you by Pelagic High Performance Offshore Gear. We just had a big, big school of tuna just jump out of the water. Big, big fish. They had huge sickles on them. They were big fish. Go ahead, Mark, 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 go ahead. Go ahead. All right. You guys got to come to the side. We got all the frigates in here right above us. So hopefully the tuna will come up a minute. There's my marks. Come back here. Switch spots with me, Manny. Oh, we got him now. We got him now. Now you in. Get him, get him. What in the hell? He's a good fish. Oh boy, there he goes. He just realized he's hooked. Hey, just make sure you're chunking. Right here, baby. <laughs> right here. Oh my God. Gaff, 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 gaff. Holy, what's the matter with you? Oh my God, are you kidding me? What are you trying to do? You're gonna break the line. Oh, what in the hell is the matter with our gaffing team here? It's just like nobody's ever gaffed a fish before, Howard. And that's your gaff. Hey, right here under the boat. Hey, you accidentally hooked one. What do you know? Oh, it's a dead one. You gotta love it, man. Overcast conditions, it's nice and cool. And we're out here bending rods. Oh, there's one. Anthony's got a black. Creep fishing, red hot fishing. Board the loose cannon. Fishing out of Port Lacaya. Stayed at Pelican Bay. Great accommodations. And real close to the action. Here it comes. Nice yellow here. Alright, just play him out. Oh, he's not that big. Maybe. He thought he was big. Here we go. Oh, there it goes. Nice going away shot, Howard. Hold him right there. The you waited too long. You weren't ready. That's the big fish. Come on, Manny! This one's the one. 
Manny's had a huge struggle over the last few months. Manny is off! He's hooked up probably, I don't know, one, four dozen. Oh! oh! You suck. Manny's on for another one. He gets another opportunity to catch a fish. Chances are he's going to blow it. Like yeah, Mike said, anybody can catch a tuna except for Manny. I've had a hard time this season, I'm not going to lie. Oh! It was tough, you know, I hooked a lot of big fish. Uh, I lost a lot of fish and uh, I, I took a lot of ribbing from the crew, all in good fun. Oh! Such a disappointment, bro. But well deserved, you know, you hook a fish, you, you expect it to get it in the boat. You did everything right, Manny, except catch him. Wah, 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 wah. Hold on. What in the f up with the you guys in the gaffs? Alright, Manny, good one! Woo! Manny caught one! The struggle has come to an end. Manny has landed a fish. Yeah. <laughs> he said, yeah. Haters. Haters gonna hate. You know, you know how they are. They're ugly. The moms don't like them. You name it, you know? It's all good. <laughs> I got a tuna, I got, I got a tuna, tuna, I got a tuna, yeah, 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 yeah. Tuna season's been tough, you know? It's my first season on a loose cannon. Been doing a lot of fishing all my life, but you know, coming over here doing the tunas for the first time, it's pretty fun. Lost a bunch of big fish, caught a lot of slack over it, but redemption. Last two trips, I've caught some nice ones. These guys, you know, they're back there hogging the good spots and cherry picking the base. <laughs> it's all good. It's all good. It's been a good summer. Hey, Team Loose Cannon, it's been a great summer, man. We've been crushing it all summer long. Stay tuned, man. It's a killer show. Yay! You suck. Loose Cannons is brought to you by... Angle Coolers, the original way to keep adventure on ice. Conley Fishing, the number one source for serious fishing equipment. Dolphin Electrial, the power choice for serious fishing. And by Pelican Bay Hotel, Port Lucaya, Grand Bahama Island. All right, go ahead. Oh, oh God. Here. Woo! Had a baby, Mikey. Pick it up, buddy. Pick it up. Oh, that's a good fish. Pick that up, dude. You're gonna break the pole. That's a good fish. <laughs> Just a warning. <laughs> Still chunking? Get that jelly clean and jerk coming. You still up. chunking? Yeah. All right. I'm trying to get mine out of your oh, way. Buddy, up up Don't let that line touch the boat, man. You'll lose them. I'm just telling you, you'll lose them. Watch out, man. Come on, baby, sling it. <laughs> it started 37 years ago. <laughs> he took the same medication Michael Jackson took to change the skin color. Except I lived. Anthony's got a real big problem with that fish right now. Yeah. The fish is beating his ass. Oh, oh my god, that almost went out. It almost I got went it. Out. I got it. I got it. I got it. I don't got it. I got it. That's a nice fish. That's a good one. Oh, oh it's a good one, though. It's Damn. Good that was a big fish. Dude. That was a big freaking fish. Anthony had the biggest fish on, well, I think. And uh, like I said, if he didn't hurry up and get it up, he was going to bite it to a shark. So that's what he did. Okay, I'll never said that. Didn't I tell you it was going to happen? It wouldn't break my heart to have a belt. We're not. Jeez, you sound like a little child. Well, Jesus. Like Here, I'll pull my pants down. Yeah, freaking cry, baby. 
Oh, thank you. Could you pull up something? Hold on, don't move. Really? I got this. Hey, oh my get god. Out of there, you backwards. Wait, oh my god, it, it's it's hurt just a little bit. Oh, just a little bit. Right. All right, all right, see? Oh, oh. You don't, don't move. Don't anybody breathe. It slips a little. Oh. Okay, let me walk back. He's going down. The pin's actually on the. Yeah, but you need a reel, man. You're going to lose him to a shark, too. Manny's trying to break me off. I'm trying to get away from Manny. Let me get the ball. Come on, man. Go forward. Go forward, Mike. Come on, Michael. Come on, buddy. Trying to go in one to one. I got nothing, dude. I'm at sunset. I got nothing. I think I've gone from tuna to shark. We got Anthony losing fish to sharks. Manny finally reeled one in. Howard's got one on. I'm just cleaning up the boat. And, uh,. Mike's still up there fighting the same fish he's been fighting for the last 30 minutes. Oh my god, hey Joe! Where's the other gap? I got it, I got it right here. Monster, right here. bro. I got it right here. Don't let that line oh, touch the boat! He's coming, he's coming, he's coming, he's coming, he's coming, he's coming, coming, he's 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 coming, Wow, he's, look he's, at that thing. He's probably, I'm going to say 70 pounds, 70, 80 pounds. He's a beast. Damn. He's got some shoulders on him. It took him a while. He thought he was a shark. He got him in the boat, man. It's a good fish. We weren't even going to come out here. Seas were rough. We weren't even going to come out here. Captain says, you know what? Let's go. Let's get on the boat. Let's go give it one more shot. It's probably the last tuna trip we're going to do this summer, and, and it paid off, man. That's a good fish. Yeah. That's a good fish. <laughs> The whole summer is just nothing but catching fish day after day after day. Something interesting every day. Now you got to thank Joey. I mean, mostly except for my vast knowledge and handsomely good looks. But other than that, Joey has the boat. So that's what really ultimately matters. Not bad at all. Grab your hook. Where he goes next. Go no, don't. Get him, get him, get him. We've been coming over here crushing it, man. Unbelievable summer. Probably the best summer of my life. We saw a whale shark this summer. We saw tiger sharks, numerous sharks, slob tunas, slammer gaffer dolphins, you know, deep dropping yellow eyes, man, we've done it all. It's been blowing up. Loose cannon, that's how we do, baby. Hey, I think you're a little concussed. You need a bag of ice on that forehead. I need a bag of peas. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> stay in the game, stay in the game, stay in the game. Watch it, coach. I'm out. Loose Cannons is brought to you by Pelagic High Performance Offshore Gear, Tuppence, your complete boating and fishing headquarters, and by Venor, legendary tackle since 1933. Woohoo! It's nighttime. Oh, I saw the head shake right there. Oh, that's a good fish. That is a good fish, Manny. Manny, I'm really excited to see you one get in a boat, buddy. Especially a big one. You've been after that fish for a long time. Don't lose him. Come on, big Manny. Don't let him get the best of you. Eye of the tiger. Eye of the tiger. Listen, I want a big fish here. Come on, fellas. Come on. Come on, Manny. Come on, Manny, you're my man. Take a swig, take a swig, take a swig. Come on, come on. Take a swig, take a swig. Yeah, buddy. That's just <laughs> wrong, dude. Oh, he's big. He's big. One more. Reel down and pull up. Reel all the way down. Reel all the way down. Reel all the way down. One more time. Get it, Joe. Now he's coming here. He makes the turn. Yeah, baby. <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> yeah! 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 Yes! Woo! Look at that beast! <laughs> nice, Manny! He got Man, one! He got one! <laughs> yeah! There it is, brother! 
my boy Manny on the boat. And he's a great guy. I love having him on the boat. He's fun. He's, he cracks jokes. He has, he's got a good sense of humor. He had bad luck when it came to these tunas, especially when the big ones hit. Uh, he grabbed the rod, and for some reason they would spit the hook. I don't know if it's because they knew he grabbed it or what, but uh, you know it was ongoing. It was pretty much every trip we went on, he was having a rough time with the tuna. And we got to the point where not only did we feel bad for him, but we had to stop making fun of him. Our last trip we had the opportunity, and actually he had the opportunity to, to redeem himself, which he's been trying for all tuna season. Uh, you know, and he was able to hook a couple big ones, and uh, the last minute, I mean the last second, before we're about to pull the lines up because there's no light left. He throws one more sardine out. We're all sitting there packing everything up and washing the deck down. And uh, sure enough, he gets one to whack the line. And for the next 30 minutes, we're waiting to see if it's gonna be a shark or a big tuna. And sure enough, he got his big tuna that he was waiting for all year long. And it was just great to see him finally put a smile on his face instead of going home miserable. I had some struggles at first, but uh, I did get redemption. Um, you know, the last couple of tuna trips we did, I did catch some nice sized ones. And the last tuna trip, I, I, I uh, capped that off with about a 70 pounder. So, redemption was mine. <laughs> there you go, go Bobby. That was a nice fish. fish. Woo! That's the end of the slower season. This was the last evening. Manny finally got his big one. After all my years of searching, after all my hard work, I finally busted the method I had. The Angle High Performance Cooler. It's incredible. Just look at this lid. What a powerhouse. It's so freaking strong, so reliable. I just want to boom. Oh, man. Unbelievable. This silicone gasket's better than rubber. Take that, Yeti. You want more, huh? <laughs> Why, hello there. Are your base and sidewalls way thicker for superior insulation? Oh yeah, you bet they are. And there's so much more! The easier to open drain plug, the marine grade latches, the all around textured surfaces. Plus, no more vacuum stuck lids, superior scratch protection, and better performance in direct sunlight. Oh yes, after 10 days, still cold, still fresh. Let's hear Yeti do that. With angle coolers, it's official. The Yeti is busted.